Hello everyone, welcome back to my little channel. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. Um, if you guys are new here, please subscribe and leave me a little comment on what you guys thought about the nails. Also, don't forget to check out my online store, Zule Nail Shop. Um, the link's going to be in the description for all the products that I'm using. Let's see. Zule, you play. What do you mean, Zule? Hello. Hello everyone, welcome. Okay, let's see who's here first. Nailed by Katie. Hola, hola Katrina. Hi Chastity. Hi Eleni. Uh, niece Nails, hello. Hi Jasmine, hi Barb, hi CJ. Hi Margarita, hi Mayra, hi Tiffany. Hello everyone, guess, guess what color? Oh, fuck. You guys could see them. Fuck. Just kidding. Don't fucking guess no more. Hi, Julia. A ver, who else is coming in? Hello, everyone. Coming in. Where's my brush? Um, where did I leave my brush? Oh, here it is. Hello, everyone. Welcome. Yes, I'm going to do you. I'm going to do pastel yellow. I wait. Chonchingo, Marta. Getting ready for the 23rd. Woo, woo, woo. Are you coming? Are you coming to both classes or just one? Immediately intrigued. Hello, everyone. Welcome. So today, right here, it's 8.03. So today, I'm going to be using the color duckling. I believe both. Okay, it's because I don't... I don't recognize your name. Okay, can cannot wait to see you. I'm excited. Okay, I'm also gonna be using Glow Perfect Pink and Unicorn. Ya te las pegaste, sí, Marta. Rapidito me las pegué. Katie. Oh, okay, okay. Katie. Hello, Zach. Hello, Nesia. Katie, Katie, Katie. I'm also gonna be using. The unicorn, have you shipped the Zeho acrylic orders? Yes, Katrina. Welcome, everyone. I text you. Oh, you're the one texting me. La del aniversario, huh? No se vale. It's because it's already late. So I was like, bitch, come on, get started a little bit. Hello, everyone. Welcome. I was debating what the fuck to do today. And I was like, you know what? It's pastel season. So that's what we're going to do tonight. We're going to do some pastel nail. And then I'm using my Kalinsky brush number 16 because it's still kind of cold. Hi, Millie. I'm doing good. And you? Are you going to make me a duck? <laughs> quack, 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 quack. Let's see. Alexa, what's the weather like right now? 49 degrees. Oh, you thought I wasn't going to come on? I was debating. I was like, should I go live? Alexa, shut up. Um, I, I was asking Patrick. I was like, should I go live or should I just record them? And he's like, I did it. I even asked El Jefe, I asked him the same shit, and they both said the same answer. So I'm like, okay, hey, Zulay, do your brushes come crimped already? Yes. All of our brushes, guys, already come pinched. So if that's something that you're into or you want to be into or whatever, um, I didn't either. I was getting ready to watch my show. What, what show are you watching? Um, What was I saying? Oh, yeah, all our brushes come pinched. 
so you don't have to like ask for it to be pinched because they already come i'm surprised patrick let you do yellow i didn't ask him about the color that's true i forgot fuck that yellow is my favorite color as long as they're not duck nails i think he should be fine yeah, I was not going to come live because it's already late, but y'all already know Zule likes to surprise. <laughs> like peekaboo, everybody. How you doing? How you doing? And I need to redo my toes, so I need a fucking color. I don't know what that little dot is. I think it's like a little dusty. What does crimp mean? Okay, um, so crimped is the same as pinched. Look, I'll show you right now when I... um. Put the bead. It just means it's pinched. Hold on. I'm going to add a little bit more. I'm trying to get bigger beads now because I'm trying to see if I can move fast. I know I could if I shut the fuck up, but I'm not going to shut the fuck up. Uh-huh. No, I cannot be without you guys for real. I am an addict. Oh, the real housewives. I never watched that before, but that sounds interesting. I'm still watching Good Girls. How many seasons? Does it have four seasons? Or just three? I'm on the almost on the end of the third season. So I'm like, what am I going to watch next? This color is so fucking beautiful. So just in case you guys didn't know, this is the color duckling. Okay, so let me show you guys what I meant about pinched. So when your brush is pinched, it's flat. It'll be flat at the tip. Versus the round ones are more puffy. I personally do not like that. I'm glad I'm catching your light before I got a chicken. Where you going, girlfriend? Oh, um, somebody asked me earlier if I'm going to do an ombre. Yes, I'm into ombres lately. I've been into ombres forever. But I don't feel like doing Frenchies yet. I was debating if I wanted to do a Frenchie. And I was like, mm, next. Nah. I'm going to be doing um, ombres and then I'm going to do some 3D flowers. 3D flowers. All right. This color is a cover. Wait, it's not a cover. It's the Glow Perfect Pink. Zule que si hizo la mayra en su pelo. Oh, se lo pintó negro. Put your, put your picture, Mayra. Te dejo. I, I give you permission to put your picture right now and then take it off. <laughs> Hello, Mason. Welcome. So this, this um acrylic glows in the dark. It is glow perfect pink. Hey, Misty. How are you? Hi from Panocha. <laughs> Hi, Panocha. How are you, Panochon? <laughs> I know you did that on purpose. Oh, yeah. So, did I finish telling you guys? I'm going to do them pink. I mean, ombres. And I'm going to do some roses. So, if you guys have been wanting to um, sign up to my 3D and bling class or my basic class. You guys have t some time. I can't believe it's already March, dude. Um, I'm going to be having them in, um, at the end of the month. So sign the fuck up, honeys, cause you about to upgrade your nails. So you have a whole glow collection that is just launched and you aren't using any of them. Not yet. I was going to use them, but I didn't really get inspired. I was like. I want a little bit of yellow. Not going to lie. I was going to do my nails blue today. I was going to do Jimena and Izzy. But I want to do them with butterflies. I kind of want to do butterflies. But I... I <laughs> Look, let me show you guys my butterfly that I tried to draw. I failed. So I was trying to draw a butterfly, bitch. Look at that little ugly shit. <laughs> I lost my inspiration real quick. I lost my inspiration so quick. Hi, Snow. How are you? Hi, Mona. You can never go wrong with strawberry lemonade colors. Uh-huh. Yeah, and I was like, man, you know what? Fuck those stupid butterflies. 
I really want to do a blue set with butterflies. Zule, look at my pig. I don't know you. Who are you? I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. How are you guys? Hopefully, you guys are doing amazing too. It's so cold, everybody. Aha, uh -huh. I love butterflies. So, right now that it's the spring, you guys are going to be seeing a lot more butterflies. Um, oh, so, so no, you guys are not boring. I just don't know what to do yet. Like, oh, I'm going to do so much, but I can't draw, bitch. So, in the meantime, I need to think of a backup. A backup, like, design. Ooh, thank you, Brian. Thank you very much, honey. Thank you, boo 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 boo. Me too, I'm ready for butterfly sets. Yeah, there's just, uh, I was like, you know what? I don't think we're ready for blue yet. Like, they're beautiful, but right now i think it's a transition for spring so i'm like okay fine let me be a little bit more appropriate with the colors um i'm gonna do a little bit of pastels here and there and then i'm a like one pastel one other brightness or whatever something not like it you know so i think my next set is going to be um blue Oh, fuck. Somebody told me to do rainbow fish. <gasps> I hope she don't show herself. <laughs> I hope she don't show herself because I did not do... Oh, fuck. I'm missing a piece of here. I didn't do no rainbow fish, honey. Uh, I say you use the Zule collection and go 90s. Ooh, that would be cute. Yeah, I need to start thinking of a design. So what I'm doing today is somewhere simple babuchona ish. I don't I don't know. I don't have butterfly stickers or do I? I'm gonna need to look at my arsenal. I do have butterfly um butterfly foils. But I wanted to try to fucking draw them. I'm in my nail art era over here trying to be a baddie in all areas but sadly i cannot fucking draw bitch i just cannot draw for the life of me that butterfly was just not it it was like mata me marta hi potato so i'm gonna be doing three nails with the ombre and then the other ones are gonna be the ones with the 3d flowers so these colors are definitely giving some gogurt Go Gert, you need to try these copy and paste sets aren't cutting it. <laughs> I know, I know, I know, I knew. I need to try it. That's why I was trying it on the fucking fake nail, but oh, you know, I just couldn't do it. I need to keep trying though. I'll try again tomorrow. Um, but I also want to do some flower nails. I want to show you guys my improvement. I was looking at some, some fucking flowers that I painted on one of my clients a while back. Versus some that I painted on her this weekend that passed. And I was like, okay, girl, you're getting better. But why can't the butterfly be cute like that? So, huevo con jamón nails? Fuck, for real. Tienes hambre, Marta. Tienes hambre. We love your artwork. Thank you. I feel like mm, I'm more about like 3D and bling. I'm not really nail art. So, I'm like, let's get better. Chulas. Together. Together. We gotta make these beautiful nails. So, check it out. I'm making this super, super thin um, because I'm gonna encapsulate. So, again, if you guys are from the Inland Empire or surrounding cities, don't be afraid, bitch, to travel to the to Riverside for this class. This is your sign. If you want to get better at your acrylic application, your 3D flowers, your bling, whatever, honey, um, join me for my um, basic class or my 3D and bling class in March. I'm um, actually, um, one of my followers convinced me to, 
to offer a little bit of poly gel so if you guys have been wanting to do poly gel as well i'm gonna try to i mean i am going to i'm gonna include a little bit of poly gel in my class in my beginner acrylic class um to give you guys an, another alternative as well so i'm really excited i feel like this year is going by way too motherfucking fast though patrick and spongebob vibes Oh, I want to try to draw Spongebob. He looks super easy, but whatever looks easy is not easy. So I think the next couple sets, I'm going to try to whip out some nail art brushes. Earlier, I was um doing a tutorial. Oh, you know what else I want to do? I want to do some cherry blossom nails, like a Nezuko inspired set. I'm going to put glitter on my ring finger and my index finger. I already have my design planned out, guys. So I hope you guys like them. They're so pretty. Who else is here? Hello, somebody write them down. She will forget. I know. Type it up for me, please. I want to do some cherry blossom nails. I saw, I actually saw an inspo on Instagram. And I don't think my flowers are going to come out like that. But maybe, maybe. Um, I could have sworn they were by Yvonne Nails. They disappeared. But they were like pink. Two shades of pink. If anybody knows who did them, please send them to me because I lost them. And then, um, yeah. What else did I say? I want to do some, some butterflies. Are you giving a class? Yes, in um, Riverside, California, guys. How about doing a bouquet of tulips? That is so cute. I try to do tulips a year or two ago they were a little fail <laughs> they were a fail they look like little roses hola marta hola como estas como están happy monday happy lazy monday are you guys into mondays what's your least favorite day your least favorite day of the week Hola, Dalia. Hola. Bienvenida. Monday's your least. I want to love you. I haven't said that in a long time, huh? Tuesday's your least. Tuesday's you guys' least favorite day? Why Tuesday's? Why is Tuesday your least favorite? What happens on Tuesday? Is it trash day? Sunday, Monday, every day is Friday for me. I don't even remember what the fuck I asked. Did I say your favorite day or your least favorite? Tuesdays feel worse than Monday, Sunday, because Monday's next. Eee, muy hermosas, gracias. Because it's pointless. Ah, For me, I hate Fridays. I don't know why. I hate Friday because that means I have to go back to work the next day. And then there's traffic. Beautiful colors. So for those of you guys that are just joining, the colors that I'm using tonight is um, Duckling. We have a full um, pastel collection. Oh, damn. I put a little too much. We have a full pastel collection. If you guys haven't... Um, check them out. They're super beautiful. This is one of them. This is Duckling. Quick, 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 quick. Estoy usando mi, pa mi pincel número 16. So check it out. Super thin and ready to get encapsulated. I think I'm going to encapsulate them first because then I'm going to get glitter. I'm doing my non dominant hand. How can we sign up for class? Jasmine, you can text me to my phone number. Um, let me put it right here. Oh, shit. Hold on. Did you unlink your IG from your bio? No, I never had it. 
I never had it linked. I don't know. You can link it. Okay, so that's my phone number. If you guys want to sign up to my in-person class in in Riverside, you guys can text me there. I'll send you the info if you don't already have it. But I'm having two classes. One of them is going to be for acrylic application. And the other one is 3D and bling. So if you guys enjoy these... um lives and you learn from them you will learn way more from in person i feel like i'm very detailed so oh yeah you need to do that it's easier for people to find your info ah, i didn't know i could link it or if i did i don't know why the fuck i didn't do it honey honey is you late you sleeping on it honey honey how many of you guys are gonna be duckling twins with me i'm thinking I'm going to do a fake hand next time. Zule is the best teacher I know. Ah, uh, thank you. I'm the funniest teacher because everybody else is so serious. Not me. Not me, honey. I'm funny. <laughs> I'm funny and perverted. Okay. I should put that in my flyer. If you don't like funny or perverted, don't come. Because Zule says funny jokes. Hey, amiga, I'm so excited for my order to arrive. Yeah. Um, so I learned with a little bit of mixed. Okay. So I am mostly self-taught in a sense. But I did go to school. So... When I first started doing nails, I learned from a magazine because back then, that's what we learned through pictorials. Hold on, I'm at a little bit more. It was more like pictorials than anything. And I did take a class as a beginner. So during the same time that I was going to school for um, my manicure license, I did invest in some nail classes where they taught me how to shape how to encapsulate stuff and how to um do 3d flowers and then i just kept taking classes so don't don't ever stop learning keep keep taking courses even after you think you know everything mm, i think it's been like two years ago right after two I don't even know. Two years ago, I want to say, I took a nail art class in Las Vegas um, for painted art because I suck at that. Um, I didn't get too much better, but I was definitely um, shocked at what I was able to draw. Let me see. Do I have um? I don't even know where they're at, actually. I'm not even going to start looking. Um, but I was like, what? I, my little lady that we drew looked like a trasvesti like she looked kind of manly but it was okay because hey at least she looked like a person i was like what i was shook it we had to draw a lady mine had a like hella unibrow and then some flower nails and stuff like that um mine was not obviously the worst in the class so i was like Ooh. Yeah, okay, it's not that good, but I ain't the worst. So uh, after that, I gained a little confidence with nail art brushes. And um, I still try to practice nail art. I showed you guys, if you guys got here early, that um, I tried to paint a butterfly. That shit was whack as fuck. <laughs> But I shall not give up. I will do another butterfly. I just didn't want to do it today because I feel like I need to research butterflies. Because the one I was looking at was a little too difficult. Hey, Zule, I see you're doing your nails a few times a week. How do you do your nails often? Oh, Alejandra, good question. I actually just posted a video earlier today. Um, like literally an hour ago or so, um, on that specific question, go check it out on my feed. Um, I showed you guys what I do to not damage my nails or anything like that. 
Baisle, you want to play tonight? <laughs> what did I do? I forgot already. Please, I need to learn. Can you teach a class in Miami? Um, I don't think I will be coming to Miami. The closest to Miami is going to be Texas. If God allows us, um, Secret Nail Fair and I will be having a class in Texas. Um, it's already March, so maybe we're going to start, like, taking payments for that. Who the fuck is calling me? Hold on. My sister is calling me. Hello? Dude. What happened? Are you live? Yeah. Look. What the fuck is on. that? Look. I found your triplet. Bitch. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> send me send me the website so I could watch it. I want to watch Naruto again. Until I finish it. What a bitch. What if they take it off? You don't have time to watch it. Yeah, I do. No, you don't. You're watching One Piece. Then you watch One Piece. That is when we eat dinner. And when are you going to watch this? When you go to sleep? No, when I'm walking. They're like, hi, Reina. Hi, when you're walking. Yeah, when I exercise. Don't you? No, bitch. I'll eat shit if I walk and do orders. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I thought you walked and did orders. No, I uh, walk to the rack and that's it. And what kind of nose does he have? Uh, shut the fuck up. <laughs> you see? <laughs> You're a bitch. Hold on. Know. Hold on. Let me... Let me show. Look, guys, my sister's saying that this is my fucking twin. <laughs> it's a chata. George said, he, What the fuck is a chata nose? It's I'm like, dude, you're not a true Mexican if you don't know what a chata is. A chata is a pig nose. Do you guys know what a chata nose is? I need that brush. Where can I get it? You guys can find it on my website. The link's on my bio. Raise your hand if you guys know what a chata nose is. What brand is the cover? Everything that I'm using tonight, you guys can find on my website. The link is on bio. Is, isn't Naruto on Netflix? Yes, but not everything. Huh, Reina? Not, not, not Only when they're little. We sure do. I know, I know. So the color that I'm using, the pink one is um glow perfect pink. We shall do. Why they said yes. Because I need to look at the comments. Uh, I know. What? what? They say, they say they yeah, they, yeah, they, they do. What, what state are you guys from? Where's your family from? The ones that do know what a chata is. On Hulu, they have everything. In English? They're like, hi, Reina. No, they don't. They don't have everything. We watch the, in Hulu, and then it, so, the, everything that goes after that isn't there. It stops halfway. It stops halfway. Guerrero, Mexico. Yeah, that's why I stopped watching it, because they didn't have it on Hulu and Netflix. Alright, once I finish it, I'll, I'll send you the link because if other people start watching it, then it's gonna get blocked and you know, so I, I just rather finish it first. Bitch, you're almost done. Send it to me. Send it to me. Stop being a Bye. bitch. Bye. <laughs> That's, funny. That's messed up, huh? She don't wanna fucking share. So, I stopped watching Naruto a long time ago because, okay, so for those of you guys who don't know what Naruto is, go Google it. It's an anime. It is such a nice anime. I love it. The story is so sad, but it's funny, too. So, when when they're little, Naruto is little. I got you with a link. Okay, mommy, text me. 
when Naruto is little, um, it's on Netflix. But as they get older, there's like a time skip when they get older. And um, it's not all there. Or it was in Japanese. And I'm like, bitch, I ain't trying to fucking read the fuck. I'm trying to multitask here. So when I watch shows, they need to be in English. Because if they're in a different language, I cannot multitask. I like to listen to the things while I do other stuff. Maybe Zorro. They usually have everything and it's free. Zorro. What is that? A different app? So, yeah. If you guys need something to watch and you guys are like, I'm not into anime. You guys should try it. It's cool. I never thought I would get into it, but I really like it. Try Crunchyroll. Uh, I think it's on there, but it's in Japanese. Everywhere that we found it, it it's on um Japanese, not in English. So we I left off in the war. And I really want to keep watching, but I can't because it's in Japanese. But okay, thank you. Whoever sent me a link. Thank you. Thank you very much, honey. Alright, let me see. Let's thank the people who are tapping. Who is tapping here? Thank you, Nena, for the rose. Thank you, honey. Thank you. Have you tried polygel nails? Yes. Yes, I have. I was considering if I should do polygels tonight or not. But I don't really have a lot of colors to choose from. That's why I decided to do acrylic. Um, thank you, Mammy. Oh, we're talking about um Naruto. It's a anime. My sister's a fucking bitch. We were the ones who showed her about Naruto. Now she don't want to share. <laughs> the one who pushed to keep growing. Okay. Okay. I'm going to close these real quick because I'm going to do the other two nails with... Um... I love that my son watches it. Yeah, I love it too. I used to watch it. Ooh, when Patrick was smaller, I used to binge watch. What's better that or acrylic? Because I bought the poly gel, but it keeps breaking in half. Um, Jazz, whenever something breaks, whether it's poly gel or acrylic or any enhancement, um, most likely it's because you're not making the nail thick enough. So actually, I'm, I still need this one. Um, this this pink one is called Glow Perfect Pink, and the yellow one is called Duckling. I'm gonna leave it there so you guys could see it. All right, I'm gonna use a color, um, Unicorn, which is a nice chunky iridescent glitter. I'm gonna use this one here. And I'm sorry if I didn't answer your question earlier because I mentally responded. How to call it? Um, somebody asked that if the acrylic is runny, the clear one, but it's not. Our clear acrylic is not runny. It dries actually pretty fast. But right now that it's it's cold, it dries like at a nice speed. Nine seasons on Netflix of Naruto in English. I'm going to have to check it out again then. I just did my toes with poly gel. came out great. Yeah. I want to do my nails with poly gel too. Because I like to have a little, a little length on my toes. I don't like to round out my toes. They need to be square. My sister be hating when I do that. She'll be like, your, your fucking toes look crusty. Because <laughs> she doesn't like them when they're long. I'm like, bitch. Hey, girl. So crazy. I just found out you're my friend's cousin's husband. What? I just found out you're my who? My friend's cousin's husband. I don't get it. Who's your friend and your husband or what? <laughs> Who, what, when, where, why? Whose cousin am I? What the hell? Who's the cousin? Who's my cousin? The glitter acrylic. Oh, my God. It's so pretty. It's called Unicorn. Yo si te quiero. La reina no te quiere. I know. She does, but she don't know how to love. I win. My friend's husband. Who is it, though? What's her name? Who's your friend's husband? Your friend's husband is my cousin? Raul. Raul. 
Raul. Oh, is he my cousin from my dad's side? Raul. Have you guys seen that cat that goes, Raul? <laughs> what brand is the acrylic? Nail buff. It is from Zule Nails. Oh, yes, he's my cousin. Raulito, Raulito, honey. Yeah, he my cousin. I went crazy. Yeah, such a small world, huh? Actually, the nail world is not that that big. The nail world is not that big. It's crazy, crazy, crazy. To be honest, I feel like the world period is not that big. What number is the, the brush is a size 16. On the full wheel tip, you still apply acrylic on top or just gel? It depends what you're doing. You can put acrylic or gel. If you're doing a gel method, um, gel extension, then just put gel. Gel polish. ¿Qué colores tienes de poligel? Um, no me acuerdo, Marta. Pero están en mi, en mi perfil. Si te metes a mi página, allí los encuentras. Um, tengo una, una, una categoría dedicada para el poly gel. So she's asking me what color poly gels I have. But I don't remember from the top of my head. We're going to be adding more poly gels soon, though. Vamos a agregar más colores. Um, nos van a llegar como unos 30 colores más. So if you guys ordered our poly gels and you love them, you love them. Um, be prepared to, to get the new ones that we're going to have. Um, the other day I was asking on Instagram if, if y'all like the poly gels and four hoes said no. And I'm like, okay, I, I get it. Let's go see who said no, right? Cause... I was like, I ain't gonna fight nobody. That's your opinion. But you know what? These fucking four hoes, the, the four people who said they didn't like them, they didn't even buy shit. I'm like, bitch, stop fucking voting. <laughs> stop fucking voting on my shit if you didn't fucking try them. Huh? So easy to work with. I like them. I love them too. And I'm like, whatever. It's only four of you guys. So it doesn't matter. But I was like, what the hell? Either y'all don't read or y'all trying to um, trying to fucking play with me. But I thought that was kind of funny. I was like, I mean, I'm not going to get mad, you know, because sometimes I put answers just to make it funny. Like, I don't care. I'm a hater or whatever. Hi, Sharon. Welcome. But I was like, dude, y'all, y'all people didn't even really try them the question was did you like the poly gel not do you like poly gel do you like my poly gel and then there was also an option that said they haven't tried them so i was like ma'am but yeah i thought that was kind of funny i was like hey cue me do not vote on that one please vote on the one you have not fucking tried or something hi teresa name of the glitter um the glitter is called Unicorn. The pink color is called Glow Perfect Pink. It's part of our Glow Collection. Um, and then the light yellow is called... Um, ¿Cómo se llama? It's called Duckling. Can you be my new nail artist? Sure. Only if you like long nails, honey. I'm only accepting new clients for long nails, long freestyle sets. So if you like long nails and you don't have a problem with Zule choosing for you, then you can be the client. Um, porque some people be like, ay, como que you're going to pick my design? Como que she? These are looking so cute so far. That's giving... Egg broken eggshells. Really? So cute. Hola, saludos desde Reynoso, Tamaulipas, México. Hola, Mari. ¿Cómo estás? Gracias por, por venir. What size brush are you using? Um, Kiki, I'm using um, size 16. How do you record? What do you use? 
I'm currently using my iPhone. Hold on, I'm gonna take a quick little picture of the, the, my nails because they look so cute. They look so cute. But those means basic hose. Oh shit, I don't want flash. Hold on. They look so good. So good. ¿Cuál es tu forma de uña favorita para hacer? A mí me gusta mucho el, la cuadrada. Antes me gustaba la estelero, pero ya mucho. Mejor me gusta el square. Porque es más fácil. Es más fácil y se ve muy bonito. Y luego las estiletos, pues nomás están largas, se ven bonitas. El square se ve bonito en, en mediano, en cualquier tamaño. Can you do a green set? I'm gonna do a green set by before the 17th. So before um, March 17th, I'll, I'm gonna be using um, Zach color, my Zach color. Because Patrick's birthday is, look at this one. Um, it's giving me kiwi, kiwi vibes. So, my son, he was born on St. Patrick's Day. And we're not going to do him like a party and all that. But we are going to celebrate him with his little friends and shit. And I'm going to be using that color. But in the meantime, I'm going to be changing my nails, you know. Hello, Patrice. Are you taking poly gel to the class? Yes, I am, Marta. I sure am. I'm actually going to save a few for the class. I'm going to save a few of them for my class so you guys can buy. If you guys are coming to any of my classes and you want me to bring a specific anything, please text me because I'm not going to bring my whole store or anything like that. I'm just going to bring a few things. So if there's something in particular that you want, let me know. Like one of the young ladies was like, she wants a lamp. So I'm going to save it for her so she can buy it the day of the class. And then, of course, I'm going to bring glue. I'm going to bring some brushes. I'm going to bring like the popular things that I know you guys like. That's me. I want the lamp. I want to love you. I think tomorrow I'm going to try to finish bedazzling my lamp. Porque como voy a llegar a mi class con media lamp decorada. Be right back. Ok. Ah, en serio, pero me encantan tus otras uñas estileto con flores. Ay, a mí también me gustan estileto. A ver, ¿cuándo me las hago estilero? Es que lo me pico la nalga, Marta. Me pico la nacha. I love the unicorn. is my favorite. Can I see the other nails? Yeah, if I bling out the lamp, I'll I'll go live for a little bit. It takes me a long time to do it, so how do you call it? Um I'll be here for a little while. Where in Texas are you gonna be? Um Houston. Houston area. Houston area. Are any of my Texans in here from Houston? My Texans, where you at? Oh, they're all sleeping. It's late. I can't wait for the class. I'm going to be amazing. Yes, I'm excited. I'm excited. Austin. Odys Od Odisa. I never heard that one before. My uncle lives there. Hi from Texas. Hello. It's early. Not Houston, but Dallas area. Yes, Sugarland here. Okay. I thought you guys were all going to be sleeping. That's fucked up, Lenny. They left you in here. I feel like I'm being ignored. Why? I haven't seen anything of yours. Bonita. What? Did you ask a question? Honey. Did you ask a qu question? It's almost 12 a.m. in New York City. I'm sorry, guys, for coming on here a little late. How much do your classes cost? Oh, shit. Hold on. No, girl. Still early. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Um, The class, so the basic class is $650 and includes a kit, 
and a certificate. And the 3D and bling class is 500 cookies. And it includes a kit. And the certificate, of course. Do you offer do you offer afterpay? We don't have offer afterpay, but we do have the PayPal option. It's like afterpay. I need help. Okay, Bonita, what do you need help with? How can I help you? What time? What time? What when's the Texas class? in april i i mean yeah, yeah yeah like april 20 19 or 20 i can't remember the date i'm watching all the way from suriname Ooh, how cool welcome at two in the morning woo -woo, two in the morning sorry what are you guys what time is it for y'all oh, okay for me it's 8 46 p.m I'm in California. Estoy en Arizona. Can I pay you some before the class? Pay me some. Oh, like a class payment, Marta? Yeah, if you guys want to give another class payment, like payments before the class, because it's easier for you guys, you can definitely do that. Just let me know. Let me know when you send the payment, because... Sometimes people send me money and I don't know who the fuck it is. And I'm like, who are you, honey? Who are you? Who sent me money? I don't like to owe people money. So I'm like, who is it? Do we need to do we pay deposit for Texas class? Yes. The Texas class, the deposit is 200 as well. But the Texas class is going to be a different price. Um, I'm not doing it by myself. I'm doing it with Monica from Secret Nail Affair. So, wait. I'm going to reach out to her tomorrow to see if we're going to start taking payments already. But the California class, the one in Riverside, you guys can um, sign up with me. And the information on the class, you guys can text me if you want me to send it to you. I'm going to make another post again tomorrow about it. ¿Haces clases online? No, amiga, no estoy haciendo clases online. Um, my brush is a number 16. Vale. Vale. All right. I'm so excited to do the bling. Okay, honey. How long have I been take? Did I take to do these nails? Has anybody in here been here since the beginning? Beginning. Where in Texas? In Houston, Texas, guys. Houston, Houston. Do you know when you're going to post the kits? Um, I'm going to be working on them soon. I'm waiting for a couple things. So I'll post the kits maybe like in a week or so. I'm waiting for some bling to arrive because I'm going to put it in my bling kits. My 3D and bling, I mean. About one hour. Woohoo! Let me see. Let me double check. Oh, 48 minutes, dude. And I'm already almost done with application. What? That is pretty fucking fast for me. So if you guys are coming to my 3D and bling class, um, you guys are going to be the first ones to get this new bling that I ordered. Will you have another class this year? No, that's going to be the only class I have. Why? Where, where are you going to? What are you going to do, Eleni? Are you going on vacation? I only do the classes once a year. You cheated us for coming out with your nails. <laughs> I only glued them on. Huh? That normally takes me like 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Yeah. I Okay, fine. Let me say that out loud. I glued on the nail tips. Before coming live, maybe that's why it's going a little fast. But just the application, I feel like I did it a little bit faster today, no? What time is it where you're at? 
it's 8 30 8 30 my friend is getting married oh my god friend what is she getting married through church Oh, man. Or maybe you can come to the Vegas one if I have one in Vegas. Wait, are you in California? I hope it's not hot in Texas that your acrylic dries fast. Oh, man. I'm going to have to choose uh, the slowest acrylic. <laughs> Is Texas, like, li like, really bipolar? That's my one-year wedding anniversary, the day of the class. Extra special. Sorry, you didn't tell me the link of the pillow. Ay, se me olvidó, Marta. Se me olvidó. I forgot. Uh-huh. Yeah, so I have another class that I'm hoping to do in Vegas in June. Um, I was speaking to one of my, my, what do you call it? One of my idols, my nail idols, somebody that I looked up to as a beginner um and crossing our fingers we're able to link up in in june in vegas so very bipolar in one week we hit every season what the fuck for real so stay tuned if you guys can make it to the california one um for whatever reason i'll probably be in vegas well i'm gonna be in vegas for sure but I'm not sure if that's going to be a class still up in the air in June. Um, but but I won't be doing them alone. So it's going to be with somebody else. Houston is hot and damp at the same time. Oh, I, I hate the fucking heat, man. I hate the heat. I hate it so much. Can you come to Nashville? Oh, yeah, amiga. Ni sé dónde vergas está eso. Nashville, Tennessee, honey. <laughs> I don't even know where that's at. But um, those are the only places that I'm planning to go to. Other than that, I'm sorry, but I do not travel anywhere else. To be honest, I've never traveled for a class until this year. I'm trying to be a little bit more adventurous. You know, I told you guys last year that I want to try and visit somewhere new every year. The Texas class is still 420. What day is 420? Is it Saturday? Or a f um, or is it a Sunday? All right, guys. Time to cap. Did you cap the pinky? Yes, I did. Look it. All of them are encapsulated. It's a Saturday. Okay, yeah. Most likely it's going to be on Saturday then. This nail right here is a little, it's a little flatness, but it's okay. Snails be burning like crazy. Okay, yeah. Yeah, if you guys ever get like a heat spike with the gel, just take your little hand out and let it cool down for five seconds. And then you can stick it back into the light. What drill machine is that, girly? Is my drill, honey. Look, let me show you guys. It's this beautiful drill by Zule's Nails.bigcartel.com. It's super powerful. I made a video right before coming on here on the drill. Let me just file the bottom of the thing. Oh, the colors that I use are duckling. I'm going to put them right here. Duckling, unicorn, and... Glow Perfect Pink. Okay, Linda. Hopefully, I get mine this week. Yes, you should. It, it shipped out today, Marie. Check your tracking number. So, I'm just filing the bottom because people be talking shit that I don't ever file the bottom. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, bitch. I fucking do it for you this time. I do it and I sometimes I don't fucking file the bottom. I forget. All right, guys, let me get all these little dusties out the way so we can start decorating. All right. So I'm not even going to 
gonna buff actually because we don't technically need it. Actually, I'm just gonna buff it anyway. I'm so fucking used to it. Ah, uh, that's me. <laughs> My mom hates the smell monomer. How can I control the smell? Um, one thing that really helps, even though you might not think so, is how do you call it? Um, getting a trash can with a lid. Um, and changing your little napkin often as you work. So if you don't want to waste napkins, just cut them in half. And then, if, like, use one napkin on one hand and then the other one and throw them away. Because that makes the room smell more, the napkins. Another thing would be to work in a ventilated area. So you have, like, a little fan. Turn it on, but don't point the fan at you. That's one thing that I learned not to do because you can create... um. You can create bubbles in the nail if the fan or the AC is blowing towards you. Poly gel is my new best friend, right? It's fucking bomb. Also, Brittany, if you haven't tried our poly gel, I'm not sure if you bought any yet or whatever. But if you haven't, you I recommend that. It doesn't have chemical smell like that. So maybe that was gonna be your mom's new best friend. I'm I'm waiting for my next collection of poly gels so i can use them more often how do you measure your nails so they're all the same length elizabeth i don't measure my nails i just glue on the tip and that's it like i don't cut nothing at all so i look at they're not all exactly the same but semi the same i just glue the nail tips and that's it so here are the motherfucking new nails. I don't know if I should do my nails matte or shiny. What do you guys think? The Mia Secret drops. I've never tried the Mia Secret ones. I've only tried um. Okay, I'm gonna do. Okay, let's do a poll real quick. Should I do some matte or shiny? All right, let's do a poll. We haven't done a poll today. All right, should I do them matte, the glittery ones, matte or shiny? Quick poll. If you want shiny, put happy face. If you want matte, put crying face. So I'm thinking I could do the glittery ones matte and then these shiny. Ah, you guys are already saying shiny. I don't know why, but I have the song La de la Northwest, Miss Miss Westy, something, something, something stuck in my head. <laughs> I like that idea. Shame, like a diamond. You guys don't fucking like my idea, huh? Okay, maybe it's meant to be just all shiny. I love Nor. She is fucking funny, huh? Ya llegó la diabla. Nah, 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 nah. Do both. Should I do both? Fuck it. Pull for both. What do you guys think? Yes, huh? Let's try it. Fuck it. Thug life. Do both. Matte and glossy. All right. I'm going to do the glossy first. I'm going to do glossy. Oh, thank you, honey, for the like. I mean, for the gift. All right. I'm going to try. I'm going to try it. And if we don't like it at the end, we can always put top coat. So let's top coat the bitch. These nails definitely will look nice matte too. Matte is so beautiful. But shiny is even more beautiful. I don't know why, but my nails feel extra long today. Even though they're the same fucking length. I think it's the colors. That's why I voted the opposite. <laughs> Glitter shiny. Hey, Zule, I watched your newest video. Does the nail tip have issues sticking to the nail? What do you mean, honey? Which video are you talking about? Are you putting crystals? Yes, I am. I'm just going to put the top coat um, first so I could take my basic nail fee. 
The ombre is beautiful. Thank you. How do you like using number eight brush? I do not use number eight brush. I haven't used that one in a long time. Oh, I'm lying. I'm lying already, guys. <laughs> I do use a number eight, but it's a big number eight. I forget that the, the unicorn brushes, the unicorn and the princesita brushes are number eight. I keep thinking they're like a fucking 12 because they're big number eight. So I like them. I use them. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to lie. I just forgot. Slay, honey. Yeah, I'm going to make some florecitas right now. I'm going to do them on the glitter news. Wait a minute. Do I even have Matt Tuckle here? Oh, yes, Auntie. Yes, yes, yes. All right, I'm going to be using the velvet matte top coat. Oh, the video of you filing your acrylic down super thin. Does the nail tip stick to the acrylic? Oh, yes. Especially because it's um a rough surface. Yeah, it sticks good. Oh, my God. This looks so pretty shiny. I'm starting to regret it. <laughs> I don't know. I'm feeling the color yellow right now. I have it on my nails currently. Yes. Um, yellow is such a beautiful color. <gasps> oh, this nail looks so pretty shiny. And we're about to make it matte. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm starting to regret life right now. Why did I listen? I have faith. This is going to look really pretty matte, too. I like it shiny now. Me too. Oh my god, honey. <laughs> shiny looks so good, huh? Man, should we do it shiny? <laughs> nah, let's let's do it. Let's do it still. Wipe it off. Leave one matte, one shiny. Well, I could always put top coat later if I like it. All right, let me just keep going. Because I need to take a picture at least. I need to take a little picture. For my simple nail. Yeah, something different. I don't know why, but when I do yellow, I kind of want a little matte. I want a little bit of matte. I always want to do matte, but then I'm like, oh, I can't. I need a shiny. Zulia, soy una chillona o... Que ja, 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 pasé mi examen de manicurista y tengo mi licencia. Uh, oh, chingona. Uh, sí, eres una chingona, amiga. Congratulations. ¿Cómo se dice eso en español? How do you say congratulations in Spanish? Um, the glitter acrylic that I use is called unicorn. Unicorn. The colors that I use tonight is Duckling, which is the um, yellow one. Um, the pink color is called Glow Perfect Pink. And the glitter is, oh, felicidades. Ay, que tonta soy, ¿verdad? Felicidades, Marta. And the glitter is Unicorn. Zule, why does matte burn when curing? What? It should not be burning. Unless it's on your skin. If it's burning, it's because it's on your skin. Oh, fuck. I touched the nail. <laughs> uh oh. Yeah, it should not burn unless you have it on your skin. That shit burns. All right. Let me take a quick little picture. Hold on, guys. Let me um take a quick picture. All right, I'm going to try to not touch. Ooh, yes, honey. Phew, 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 phew. I look like a pendeja posing like this, but... Hold on, let me get my lamp. But I don't want to touch the nail. 
All right. Oh, fuck. I bumped. I bumped it. Oh, they're matte already. Oh, my God. I hope they look so pretty. So, somebody was asking if you could do nails while you're pregnant. Um, You could, but I wouldn't recommend it. Because what if you throw up on your client or something like what if you get nauseous? I'm sure pregnant girls get nauseous. And imagine with chemicals, honey, you're going to get even more nauseous. Yeah, I'm going to show you guys the lamp right now. Hold on. Let me cure my nails. I'll show you the lamp. Oh, you did nails while pregnant? All right, hold on, guys. I've I've seen a lot of women do nails while pregnant. So do you can? Ooh, look at. So let me show you guys the lamp. Let me zoom out a little. You can keep working until your body doesn't want it want to work no more because the chemicals get stronger with look it so it does not include the decorations these are my own i'm gonna try to um finish it tomorrow so it comes with these different settings with a little led here mine's already fucked up porque well not fucked up but i my nails be big as shit hey bitch all right, I'm going to put 60 seconds. And the little light is pink in there. When I'm pregnant, every time I love bleach smell, like way better than food smells. What? For real? My gyno said it's fine as far as doing them. Okay, yeah, just make sure to be in a well-ventilated area because you don't want to get your baby high. The mat. I'm a beginner nail tech and I just found out I'm pregnant 10 days ago. Oh my god, congratulations. Just wear a mask, put a little fan on, and um switch to poly gel. Hey. What? A license cuz miss doing nails. I had to give up because what? Um because of the toxic breakout from years of being a tech. Oh no, honey. Now there's other alternatives like um hold on, let me do the thumb for a little bit. Other alternatives, a lot of people are becoming allergic to hema. So try things that don't have hema. Maybe you could still be a nail tech. If I get pregnant, I'm dropping it off to Myra or Zach. <laughs> you could drop it off to Zach. He's closer. He's closer to you, no? Do you have a video doing poly gel? Um, yes, I do, Jess. Follow my YouTube channel, guys. If you guys didn't know I had a YouTube channel, I do have one. Ooh, I'm glowing. Look at the mat. What do you guys think? Yay or nay? Um, oh yeah, follow my YouTube channel. It's Zule's Nails. Zule's Nails. All right, hold on. I'm kind of sad. <laughs> Nay, yay, make it shiny. Should we make it shiny? It looks pretty matte, but we're going to put flowers on it. Yes, okay, fine. Lo que diga el público. Zach will be having a baby in acrylic nails in no time. <laughs> okay, guys, let's make it shiny. Make it shiny. At least we tried it and we didn't love it. So now we know. Oh, it's just glossy. It's so much better. It should be illegal. It should be illegal to make glitter matte. It looks really pretty matte, but that looks so much nicer. Yeah, so if you guys are pregnant or you guys don't like chemical smells or whatever, but you still want to be a nail lady, 
Um, definitely give poly gel a try. I've been talking about poly gel for the last month because I recently started my poly gel adventure. And I can't believe I didn't try it sooner. Like, I'm so mad. Like, I could have been... Do you ever paint under the nail? I don't really paint under the nail. Sometimes, but I, I think it's a waste. Unless they're like clear, clear, you know? All right, that's more like it. Zach will be having that baby on a one-way flight to California. <laughs> it did look nice matte, huh? Too matte. We are not doing any more matte nails. I don't want to. It's either just shiny and that's it. There are no more matting. I want to get to the flowers already. I want to lip you. Okay, it's 9.36. How long have I been on here? One hour and 35 minutes. You guys have me playing around here. Playing better, better, better. Poor Lenny wants to leave. Y no le abren la puerta. Tap, tap, tap. Glitter is meant to sparkle. Yes. Did you put the glitter in the acrylic? It's a glitter acrylic. It's called Unicorn. I'm going to try to see if I can get glitters. Um, Like add some to the website. Just the glitter. So if you guys do gel or things like that. You guys can um, throw them in there instead of mixed in acrylic. It's almost midnight here. <laughs> Hold on, Lenny. I'll let you out right now. Like this unicorn color will go good with poly gel too. Let me open it for you, honey. Go. Go look for your daddy. Yo, daddy. Ooh, I'm glowing. Woohoo. I'm glowing. All right, let me get more monomer. All right, guys, time for some little flowers. Are you coming to Houston? Yes, Gypsy, in April. Um, Did you make the blue glitter I sent you? I don't remember. I don't have it. I need to get some. Love those glitter do loose glitter mixes yeah i was kind of thinking huh some of them all right let me add a, a lot of acetone so it could dry fast as fuck yeah i kind of want to because now that i'm gonna be doing a little bit of poly gel i need i want to have i want to be able to incorporate layer layer colors i used this one once in my poly gel set a long time ago and it looks so pretty so i'll be adding some um loose glitter mix mixes all right i'm gonna do some flowers with the same color glow pink and glow i mean and the yellow something different what days do you usually go live for sure for sure i go live on mondays so today's monday yeah, this color is gorgeous. I don't know if it's with the yellow, but it's fire. Okay, guys, hold on. Tina? Who's Tina? Aren't you Tina, honey? All right. I'm going to do my first flower in this one. Technically, it's Tuesday. <laughs> Are these poly gel? No, they are acrylic. What about the matte glitter? The one that feels raspy. What? I've never. I've never. How to call it? Um, oh, you mean sugar. Sugar acrylic. Oh, my ear. Um. Yeah, we have some of those. We have sugar acrylics. I mean, sugar. Sugar. Glitter sugar. All right. I'm going to do some little florecitas. I'm going to try to do something different today. It's almost midnight. Ooh. So 
I'm using the same two colors, the yellow, just for a little touch and a little bit of pink. Just to make something different. Nails with Tina. She, the other Scottish girl. Tina. Oh, okay. I thought that was you for a second, Tiny Tiger. <laughs> I thought that was you. I get confused. Can you do 3D hearts? I could do 3D hearts. I'm not going to do them tonight, but I know how to do them. Yeah, if you guys want to learn, um, if you guys are in California and you guys want to learn more 3D, I'm having a class in March. Damn, this is going to be a big-ass flower. Fuck it, thug life. We're going to be flower power. Flower powers. All right, I'm just trying to make something different. Can you use 3D carving gel soon? Yes, I could. Um, I want to make like a little duck or something with it. Where in California? In Riverside County. I don't know how to make characters. Okay, I'm lying. I've done them before, but I'm limited. I'm limited to characters. I don't know how to do them all. Hey, girl. Hey. I, I normally just, oh, for my class, no, they're not characters. I'm teaching 3D flowers. 3D flowers and bow. Different flowers and how to make a bow. And bling. I seen Mario said. <laughs> you know what? The Mario said was shocking. I didn't know I was capable of that. I was winging that shit. I was like, can I do it? Can I? Can I? And it actually came out. I'm using my 3D brush number six. For me, my struggle with like 3D figures is the eyes. The eyes is what, what I struggle with. Mario was bloody amazing. I was shook. If, if you guys saw the video, fuck, yes, I'm a second. If you guys saw the video of the Mario, you guys know that I was struggling for like 40 minutes into that motherfucker because he was looking like something but Mario. <laughs> Where do we sign up? Bliss Nails, you can text me. Um, I'll answer my phone number right now in, in here. You could text my number. Hold on. Oh, shit. To sign up to the class. So I, I inserted my number right there so you could text me for the, the either class, whichever one you're interested in. I want to love you. And for those of you guys who are coming to both of my classes, I do have a little gift for you guys. Um... For joining me for both days. You know what? I'm going to make it a little pointy. So I put a little bit of acetone. I put a lot of fucking acetone. So these bitches could dry fast as fuck. Fast as fuck. Do you have to be a nail tech to attend? No, you do not. This is open to beginners. Even if you just want it to be a hobby. is open to all. As long as you're willing to learn. I have um I have people who I have had students who just come for a hobby like they just want to learn for themselves. So if you want to do it as a hobby or you like it and you don't know if it's something that you want to do for a living it's better to try and see if you like it through a small class than going to nail school and then finding out you don't really like it. You know, I'd be there at both because it's an investment. Mm -hmm. Yes, it definitely is. Oh, this is so pretty already. I want to love you. Do 
this little flower is looking so cute. I gotta see when I can drive to Cali. Where where are you from? What state are you from originally? I haven't made a pointy flower like this in a long time. This is like Mexican candy vibes. What? Mexican candy? Really? Cali. Oh, okay. You live in Cali and OC? In Orange County? Oh, you used to live. Okay, you're in Arizona. Oh, okay, you're closer then. My class is going to be in Riverside. Come to Texas. Yeah, I'll be coming to Texas in April. Zule. What? Oh, el mazapan. No, hombre, Oceanside. The pink duvalin. <laughs> Fuck, for real, bitch. Zuleza nail tech, of course, she's going to cover the ombre. Yeah, I only did it so I could show a little bit of flitter. I'm not gonna. <laughs> yeah, you know, I'm gonna cover it. I told you guys I was gonna put flowers on these two. Finally, yes, girl, I'm finally coming to Texas. I'm gonna go to Houston. Um, is it hard to do the nails with the glitter in it? No, it's super easy. Super duper easy, honey. Zule one holiday to Scotland. I can't travel to Scotland at the moment. Maybe one day. Come to Dallas. I actually had my Instagram vote. Where should we go? And everybody and their mama voted Houston. How far is Dallas from Houston again? Thank you guys for pinning my phone number. My other problem is coming up with bomb designs. You just collect designs and do put them together, honey. So come to SD. Where the hell is SD, honey? Three to four hours. Ah, four hours? Oh, that's not too bad. That is kind of like going to Myra's house. It, oh, Illinois. The only places I'm going to be traveling to, guys, is to, to Vegas and, and um, Texas. So if you guys want to come to the class, you guys got to meet us in the middle somewhere. Wherever you at, come through. Come through. San Diego girlfriend, you are not that far. Come to the class. No seas huevona, Marta. No seas huevona, tu vente. Estás aquí cerquita, salgas ni dos horas. Ni dos horas, amiga. Where are the classes taking place? Um, The one in California is in Riverside. Riverside? Ooh, ooh. I'm in the middle of the U.S., Nebraska. Okay, come to the Texas. Um, the one in um, in Vegas is going to be in June. Oh, this looks so cute already. Excuse me. In June for Vegas. Um, you guys can only sign up right now at the moment for the Riverside class. So if you want to sign up, text me. They pinned my phone number right there. If you guys want to sign up to the Riverside class, I'm having two. Um, day one is basic acrylic application and all of that. I'm also going to be teaching poly gel for your nail. A little freebie for you guys. Um, and then day two is going to be 3D, 3D flowers and bling. Normally, my most popular class is the 3D and bling. So once you guys see the kit is when you guys are going to be like, oh, my God, I want a kit. And then nobody wants to use their shit. Nobody wants to see. I mean, nobody wants to see their, I mean, use their stuff. What pattern? Do you, do you all see the pattern? What pattern? <laughs> what are you talking about, honey? 
Another class I can't attend because I'll be in Houston. Imagine that. Um, Zach doesn't really want to come because he playing. He playing. When do we sign up for Vegas? Um, I still, I'm still trying to figure out the details. Um, I need to find a venue first. So if you guys are in Vegas, if you guys are in Vegas and you have a salon or space that I can rent or something, hit me up because how to call it? I would love to find the spot ASAP. All right, whoever texts me, I'll be responding to you when I'm done. Fuck, that one dried too fast. Houston is in April. In April. Wait, you doing a class in Vegas? I'm hoping to. I'm going to go for vacation um, to Vegas. So I was thinking I could just do a class since I'm there. Um, but the Vegas one is not a for sure yet. It's just an idea. Um, no, none of the classes are going to be the same price as I am. I'm going to be working with other people. So if you guys want the cheaper class or whatever, because when you're working with multiple people, the classes are a little bit more expensive. So... I think my California class is cheaper because I'm going to be by myself. But once it's more than two people, it's not up to me 100% to put the prices and stuff like that. Casino, casino. I'm not going to do a class in Bakersfield. I'm only doing these classes and that's it. I'm not going to be doing any more. So, if you guys want to take a class, take advantage. Ahorita que estamos en tour, porque I don't do classes very often. I think this is going to be my first year where I do them a couple times in the year. In different places. Color Duckling. Oh, thank you guys for um putting the... the I was going to say the ingredients, the colors... You're doing a pop-up this year? I don't know. So I was... Everybody keeps asking me about the pop-up. But I normally don't plan the pop-ups. So the way that works... I've done how many pop-ups? Three or four? I've always been invited to the pop-ups. So my first pop-up... Actually, I wasn't invited to. That one was fucking like four years ago that one i did it right after covid it was my first pop-up ever but my last two pop-ups those i was invited to so my co-worker um and her sister they obviously have small businesses and so they were doing a pop-up and they invited me to be a part of it so i was like okay and last year i got invited by mimi to be at her the pop-up with her but it's not something that I do on my own. Because the location is really um, important. Like, it's hard to find a location for things like that. Also for classes. You can't just have a class anywhere. That's why it's hard to, to kind of like set do those little events, you know? Um, I mix acetone into my monomer so that they can dry faster because it's cold right now. So I put plenty of acetone that will help your acrylic dry faster. Um, the duckling one already dries pretty fast. The other one, the the pink one, the glow pink, doesn't dry as fast. So that's why some beads come out a little dry the other ones don't Woohoo! congratulations any tips for new nail techs in school right now um maddie just practice as much as you can i was just talking to a bunch of beginners the other day on my instagram how y'all are not allowed to give up so easily because in the beginning 
in the beginning, nails are going to be coming off left and right. Everything's just going to be super hard in the beginning, but the more you do it, the easier it gets. But just know, um, it's take it like an internship when you guys are new. When you guys are new, your first year or two, take it like an internship. Don't expect to make all the money in the world. The experience costs more than money. So even if you don't make money off the the nails you do, it's okay because you will make the shmoneys, honeys, when you get good. So just keep pushing. If you can have a regular job while you practice or whatever, do that. Um, that way you're not as like, um, what's a good word? Um, you don't feel the pressure, I guess, to make a living, you know? So, um, I'm going to give you guys an, an, an example. So when I was a beginner, when I first started, I used to have my regular job for the first year. I still continue to go do my real job. And on the weekends or times off is when I would take a client or two or like my family, anybody who wanted nails. I do them on my free time on the weekends. And I didn't really make any money off of it. It was, like I said, an experience. You are going to go get the practice because even though you do shit for free, sometimes they still don't let you like like I wanted my sister to let me do her nails she didn't really let me cuz she doesn't really like them or whatever some people just don't want you to practice like even if it's free right cuz they're like fuck that your shit sucks so no so even if you have somebody that's willing to pay a little bit or whatever accept it even if you take a whole day doing their nails and you made 20 cookies hey remember as an intern in any other job most of the time you do not get paid honey you work for free you work for free until you learn whatever, like a, a medical assistant or whatever the fuck. They, most of the time, they wouldn't get paid. From what I remember, they had to come, they complete the hours. So just consider it like that. And then once you get real good and those bitches that didn't want to pay you when you sucked ass, then now you could be like, you know what? My sets are minimum X, Y, Z amount, okay? And then they're going to be like, what the fuck? Be like, yeah, bitch. So you should have started with me since I sucked, ho. But you didn't want me to practice on you, so too bad. That's the best feeling after. When they didn't want to support you, but now you good, or you almost good, or you better. And then now they want an appointment, and you're like, nope. Nope, ho. Um, but yeah, let's see what else can I tell you for beginners? Um, don't feel like you can't work from your house. You could always travel too if you guys don't have space in your home. Like me, when I was a beginner, I didn't have anywhere in my house to do nails. Um, I had to do them outside, bitch. I had to literally, if I wanted to do nails... I had to take my ass outside in the front where everyone can see me, where the sun would hit us. And I like to share this story all the time because people think that we never started from the same place. But I did. I sure fucking did. And I think I, I started worse than some people because I had to do them outside, bitch. So let me tell you guys this little story real quick. So I used to do nails outside of my mom's house, right? So... My dad had a carpa. He still has a fucking carpa outside. And okay, let's pretend this was the out the front of the house. The carpa will cover the top, right? There's all the cement space. And how to call it? Um, this was Zule. She start here. She start somewhere right here. And at noon, when the sun was going up, I had to start moving around like. <laughs> And then when the sun would start going down, I had to come back because then the sun would hit us and stuff like that. So, yeah, that's where I started, bitch. Uh -huh. What job policy do you recommend? 
Jazz, I recommend our products. If you haven't tried them before, we have a full line of products. We have gel, acrylic, poly gel, sculpting gel, bling bling, bling glue, brushes, everything. Everything you need to do nails, we carry. And it is a great, great quality at an affordable price. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to put bling or balls. I'm still debating. I just did my first acrylic set on myself today with my kids running around the house making a mess. Yes, chaparrita. Get it, girl. Um, when I... Back then, Patrick would steal my buffers when I would be doing nails on my clients. He'd come and he'll tell them about dinosaurs and tuck their little ear off. And then he'll fucking come and steal my buffers and put them behind his trains. I love the nails on your left hand. A sad thing is that nail techs that are big now hate on me that I'm a beginner. What do you mean? What do you mean, Jackie, they hate on you? What do you mean exactly? Like they, they um, they're intimidated by you or what? I love your flowers. Thank you. Thank you, guys. A big shout out to Tiny Tiger. She's very helpful. Yes, she is. Yes, yes, yes. When did you do those? who the nails i did them last year actually they came out as a memory so sometimes when my tiktok gives me memories i repost them like i posted a tiktok right and they were rude talking about your nails r r a oh no it's just people on on social media are rude af they forget where the fuck they come from like, never forget where you come from, guys, when you guys become popping and shit. Because just one minute you're up, the other minute could, you are down. ¿Qué pasó? No, es que bajé a, a, a poner la comida al, al refrigerador. Uh -huh. Pero me acordé que si había servido la, la birria, le pregunté a José y dijo que no. Y la puse a hervir. Uh -huh. Ahora voy a esperar a que hierva para... Hoy te la vas a comer tú. ¿O cómo, vas a, ¿Cómo vas a tirar la comida? Pues yo ya no quiero. Yo nomás quiero una vez. Yeah, some people, they, they get full of themselves. And I want to say nine out of ten people are full of themselves once they get good and shit. So please don't fucking be like that because baby Jesus will humble your ass so quick. Like... People forget that what goes up must come down. So you can have your 20 minutes of fame or whatever. But then later on, what you're going to do? And then another another thing is you can't forget. You can't. No, no, no. Just kidding. Be nice to people because you never know who's going to fucking be on top of you later. That's something that I've learned since the beginning. Like, don't fucking be mean to people because you never know who's going to be your boss, bitch. Who's going to be your boss? Who's going to be your whatever? Who you're going to be asking for help later on? I've been super lucky and only had positive experience in the nail world. Yeah, um, the nail industry and just TikTok, period is very negative but little by little um is be they're becoming a little bit more friendly i fell into the z holes at the beginning though yeah right here we are super friendly we try to be friendly but i guess we're gonna thank whoever reported me on instagram a few years ago because if not i would have never came to fucking tiktok so i got sent to jail years ago like two years ago and that's how i ended up on tiktok This is why I love coming to your live. Yeah, and then ignore them. If they talking shit about your nails, it's because they're unhappy with themselves. Like, people always have something to say. My nail experience so far has been really negative, and now that I'm in getting good, my fam is using me. What? Don't, do not allow that, girlfriend. Do not allow them to use you. Let them. People are going to talk no matter what. Yup, that's true. They're going to talk. 
good whether you do good or you do bad. So just let them talk the talk. And unfortunately, yeah, family and friends do like to use, but you can use them too. Use them as model, honey. Use them as model. Don't be afraid to use your family too. Just the way they want to use you, use them back. Eep. Amiga, I just bought the bling glue bottle and the diamond gel. Do I refrigerate both? No, just the glue. The bling adhesive goes refrigerated. The cluster gel, no. When people hate on my nails, I just ask them. They want to see them closer. I can arrange that. <laughs> no, be like, take a picture. Last longer, ho. Be like, you want to see my nail hole? Because I could show you closer. They would have been hating if there's nothing to hate on. Avi, you're doing something right. Exactly. And unfortunately, people are always going to say negative stuff because they are unhappy. So whenever they want to be spreading like negativity, it's because something is going on in their life and they are unhappy. They want to be like you or something else. There was three reasons that I read once. Good night, Julia. Um, no, just just um refrigerate the glue, not the activator. Just the glue goes refrigerated. The activator does not. The activator or the cluster gel doesn't go. Doesn't go um refrigerated. Oh ma la la tele de arriba ya no sirve ya. Sí, ya, ya, ya me di cuenta. Allá andaba yo salita para afuera cuando estaban queriendo la baja de arriba. Uh -huh. Ahí les, les ayudé tantito. The same people who were hating on my nails are now asking to book. Yes. And that is where you're going to be like, bitch, bye. Tiene unos posibles fundidos. Mm -hmm. Hello, Selena. How are you? Troubles. These nails are coming out so cute. I can't wait for you to show me how to do roses. Those are going to be your least favorite. Everybody always hates the roses. From all the classes that I've had, everybody always hates the roses because they're harder. Your voice are very similar to tell mom hello. Dijeron hola. She's half asleep right now. She don't hear mm -hmm. shit. I love the roses. Yeah, they're beautiful, but... Um, I hope you guys get it real quick, real quick. What's the name of the pink acrylic on the yellow? It's called um Glow Perfect Pink. My roses come out looking like a panocha. Uh-huh, that's exactly how your shit is going to be. You need to come to the class, Sharon. Come to the class so it won't be looking like no fucking panocha no more. Yes, we have space in both of our classes. So if you guys want to sign up, text me. I'm going to put my phone number again so you guys can text me, okay? It's in Riverside. A ver, enseñanos tus uñas. Look, guys, this is my mom's nail still holding up. She got the cluster on, on fleek and her button fly. These are poly gel nails. She hasn't lost not one fucking diamond, bitch. Ya perdí piedra, no, a ver la otra. That's too far, eh? Pero pa, pa las pito appointments se van más lejos. Baby cluster. Vente en el pinche Uber, Marta. Está muy lejos. ¿Dónde vives? ¿Dónde vives, honey? I'm gonna do one more. Uh... Where do you live that is too far? To another state? I live in Sac. Is that Sacramento? Oh, if that's Sacramento, girl, I've had people come from farther. So cuando uno quiere, puede. I went all the way to Vegas 
to take a class before. Ajá, para el Chile appointment fly out even. Ajá. Sí, pero cuando van a buscar el pito, se van hasta México. Pero para una clase no quieren venir. Girl Sacramento is not far. Janie drove from Texas. <laughs> For real. Don't use that as an excuse, guys. When you guys want something, you will do whatever it is in your power. I actually had somebody come from the Bay Area. Are you in here, Marisbel? She came to my class last year. I've had people come from like Idaho. I have, um, who else? From Chicago. Um, Dalia has came to all of my classes and she's in Chicago. So, no excuses, amigas. If you really, really want it, you come. I'd fly from Illinois, but not this time. Um, it's an investment. Uh -huh. And I'm not just saying that to my class. I'm just saying in general for whatever. If you want something, you will find a way. I remember once I had this lady who was like, I be in Santa Ana or Anaheim. I don't know what the fucking name. I used to be in LA and she thought. I was too far for her. And I'm like, dude, you do not want it then. That is like 30 minutes, honey. Wait, is it a one day class? I have um two days. I'm doing two days. One of them is, um, so they're separate classes. Day one is a basic class. And day two is 3D and bling. So, um... You don't have to take both classes, but whichever one you need the help with. Most of my girls, well, not most of them, but half of the girls that are coming to day one are coming to day two. So shout out to you, honey. Are your classes good to use for continued education? Of course, they're good for continued and for beginner education. So a lot of people go to nail school thinking they're going to learn everything they need to know about nails, but you don't. What you learn is the basics, what is necessary for state board. You do not learn. Well, at least I don't know about now, but back then shaping was not really a thing. So they didn't really teach us how to shape. They didn't teach us how to do flowers. They didn't teach us a lot of things. We're in 2024. So maybe now it's different. Zule, will you offer online classes? As of right now, I don't have any plans of teaching any online classes. But maybe in the future. Oh, I mean, you can use the hours. Oh, okay. They don't do that here in California. But you know what? Yes, Jackie, that's what Dahlia does. So one of our Z-hoes, she comes every year to... Uh, my classes for that to use it for her um for her continued education because i was like at first i was like you didn't learn amiga did you what happened you came again and she told me that that's what she uses it for i'm like ah okay i was like yeah, bad teacher <clears throat> yeah she also comes from chicago i was like did you not learn last year but no, she just enjoys it. How old do you have to be to become licensed? I believe 18. But I could be wrong. Check on your state, Jackie. Yeah, it varies from state to state. But I'm almost positive you need to be 18. Because you have to um, graduate from high school or have a GED. Um, the class, each class is one day. The, there are different classes. So I have the, the basic acrylic class is one day, March 23rd. And the 3D and bling one is a different day, um, the, next, the following day. Oh, yeah, we are in the same state, but I heard if you're licensed, you can't be home based. Yeah, no, technically, you're not allowed to work from home. You have to work out of a salon, but sometimes you got to do what you got to do, honey, to do nails. 
So at least here in California, you're not allowed. Like if they call staple on you, then you're going to get a ticket. But that's why you have to choose your customers wisely. Will you offer any acrylic class in April? In Texas, I will have one class. Yeah, get sued or some. A lot of things can happen. That's why I always push people to get a a work area out of their home. Because um, technically you're not supposed to work from home. But we all started there. So I'm not going to say you shouldn't, you know. If you want information on the classes, text my phone number. Text my phone number. You roll and wipe your brush. Yes. The reason why I roll it is because you want to keep the point of your of your um, brush. Once you lose, once you lose the point of the brush, la ya valiste verga. In Texas, it's going to be Houston, Houston, Texas. I'm using my Kalinsky 3D brush number six. Um, what is the average average rent to booth? Um, that's a good question. I'm not sure. I from what I've seen, people charge about three hundred a week ish. That's why you guys cannot be judging others that do nails out of a, a establishment like um actual beauty establishment or anything like that because the rent be expensive so like all the time when i be giving people my prices they'll be like bitch you're crazy i'm not gonna pay for that but i work from a hair salon um so i do have to pay rent to go to work and travel and everything which is a lot of people gonna be like well that's your fault you wanted to do nails so in a salon, so that's no, we have to do it, right? Yeah, 300 a week here in California is what I've seen. Um, if you guys get a small little suite, it could be more or less. I don't know. Anybody in here in California, how much do you pay? I've been in the same spot for 10 years, so my rent isn't that expensive. But my travel, my gas, and everything, it equals to that. Um, In California, can you, I don't know, in a guest house? I'm not sure. That's a very good question. I don't know. Calla Lily? Ooh, that's cool. All right, I'm going to be adding bling now. And I want to lip you. I'm fucking cold, bitch. My patas are freezing. Hold on, let me get my... Oh, my God. Let me get my crystals out. I want the chicle, man. All right. Do you know where we can get info about doing nails in back of the house like a garage? Um, You have to Google that information. I don't know what, what requirements you need to work out of home. I, I'm not sure what the requirements are. So you would have to look that up. I don't want to give you guys wrong information because that I do not know. Oh, fuck. All right, guys. I'm going to be using the labeling adhesive now for the crystals and for the balls. I'm going to be using some gold balls. Um. So what I was doing right now with the file, it's just to, to remove the glue because sometimes... Um, I get glue on the wax stick and then the little bling doesn't want to pick up no more. So that's pretty much what I was doing. Oh, on the state board website. I've never even been on that website. 
<laughs> so yeah, I wouldn't have known. But yeah, check check the information on there, guys. Like a she shed has been uh, properly turned into a workspace would be nice. Yeah, a lot of people have done that. As long as no fucking hating ass client rats you out, you should be fine. That's why when I used to work from home, um, I used to just take referrals. That That's your safest bet. Ah, fuck. I'm putting three little balls. Stay bored in general. The word scares me. It is kind of scary. But you know what? Throughout the whole time that I've been at the salon where I'm at, we've only had stay bored once. And I was in there. I was not there. I think somebody called stay bored on me because I fucking got them mad. But... I wasn't even there. I was like, hey, hey, stupid bitch. Because they wanted to get into my room so bad. I think you can have a separate entrance from your home and access to water or bathroom and proper ventilation. That sounds about right. My nosy ass over here like, why were they, why were they there? Hold on, let me turn off my heater, bitch. I'm cold as fuck already. Like, why was stateboard at the salon? Is that what you're asking? Because some stupid bitch called them on us? Because she wanted us to get a ticket for something? My school got state board called on them by a previous student. Wow, what a bitch. So normally people will do that just to fuck with you. Because if you're not like up to code or whatever. Or not necessarily that. Okay, let me rephrase that. Like a lot of the things that we do at the salon. Not just where I work, but period, in general. A lot of us don't apply what we use at work. So a lot of people like to reuse their files, which is a no-no. A lot of us like to keep our little brushes in a fucking, in a cup or something cute on our desk. All our little brushes, that's a negative you're supposed to keep them in a box, labeled. Um, everything pretty much needs to be labeled. Your acetone needs to be labeled. Everything, everything, everything. Your implements need to be labeled. All that shit. And mm, not gonna lie, Zule does not label everything. I try, but I don't. I keep all my little brushes in my desk. So I would have definitely got a little fine for that. <laughs> Um, you always have to have a barbicide um, filled up. You need to... What else? Nah, that school deserved it. They were nasty and cheap. Oh, man. And then um, you have to break your little files. Throw them in the trash. You have to... What else? What else? What else? What else? I can't think right now, but of stupid little things. It's like, ma'am. Come on, bitch. Labeled and your sterilized bags. Yeah, everything needs to be labeled. So your tools, you have to have them clean. Clean. You have to label them the clean and the soiled. If you guys do pedicures, you need to have a log. You need to have a log of when you like disinfected them and things like that. Come on, bitch. Zule, we need a sticker that says fast as fuck boy. Uh-huh. Am I going a little fast as fuck today, honey? 
Like, if you drop something, you have to disinfect it and throw... Uh-huh. That, yeah, that's in the state for taste. In the state for taste. If you drop something, you have to put on some fucking gloves. Put on some gloves. Then disinfect your hands and throw it away. Like, bitch. And that was one thing that I was like, girl. Are you a stupid or what? Why you keep dropping shit? Why you keep, why you keep dropping shit, Zulay? Like, I think at school it was so stupid that we had to put the polish on the right side or whatever. Oh, my God. I used to, <laughs> I used to hate that, too. But you know what? It just teaches you to be organized a little bit. Like, I, my teacher would get mad at us when we had drinks or food, which is obvious now like dude you do not eat and drink while you're working because there's chemicals and stuff you know have you guys ever noticed that when you guys are working your okay let's just say you had a cupcake you had a little cupcake and you have it in your room the whole time it's gonna taste like chemicals have you guys ever had that happen i'd be on my hands and knees all with amounts i drop <laughs> Me too. My client. Okay, the other day I was like extra clumsy, dude. Extra clumsy. I dropped my drill twice. Twice. Let me close this fucking door and let me. I'm on. sorry, but you're not coming back in here because my feet are cold. Fucking Lenny keeps opening the door like he'll just push it. He's seven. I dropped my drill two times in less than five minutes. And my client was like, it's okay, Zile. You could like slow down. And I'm like, bitch, this is not because I'm going fast. It's because I'm clumsy, right? She thought because I was a little late that I was like dropping shit. Because I was trying to hurry up. But it wasn't that. It was just that um, I wake up clumsy sometimes. I drop everything. So sometimes I drop shit and I'll just leave it there. I'm like, you know what? I'm going to drop it again right now. So I'm just going to leave it on the floor. And then they'll be like, Zile, there's something on the floor. I'm like, yeah, leave it there. I dropped it earlier. But literally, if I drop something and I pick it up, I'm going to drop it again. So that's why I just leave it there for a little bit. Same, yes, but not with acrylic with my mom's candles at her house. Oh, hell no, bitch. Candles? I will not allow you to have candles um, the colors that I use today are duckling. Duckling is from our um pastel collection. I use glow perfect pink from our our glow in the dark collection, and unicorn. Yeah, I don't turn on candles anymore because I'm clumsy. I burned my hair once in a candle. Like, how fucking dumb am I to get near a candle and burn my little hair? I'm like, like, estaba quemando la verga, mi migraña allí. I was like, what is that smell? And it was my hair sizzling. Like, tss. But yeah, I drop everything. So now I hold the drill with my armpit. My clients be laughing. But I'm like, nah, honey, I know my ass. I know my ass. I'm gonna fucking drop this shit and no ma'am. My father-in-law smokes when I do nails. I tell him I'm gonna blow up. Oh, hell. <laughs> oh, my Lord. Like, sir, can you light that up outside? I love candles. I'm just not in the kitchen because of food. Oh, I nearly burned my house down. Curtains in the kitchen went on fire. <gasps> oh my god, really? That's crazy. That that's scary as shit. Hi, Cynthia. How are you? That yellow color. I love it. It's so gorgeous. Huh? It's called duckling. Quick, 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 quick. I love yellow. I have a drawer and I kept my drill there or I'll drop it too. Yeah, I think I'm going to need to start um, like putting it in my mandil and shit. 
I do my nails and light my candles in between finishing. I haven't caught on fire yet. Oh my god, you guys are fucking crazy. You need one of those water bottle pouches, but for the drill. <laughs> that is so true. That is so smart. I'm going to buy one. You're right. Or I could just get a crossbody purse and stick it in there. I like the reactions of my clients when they're like, what the fuck? Why are you putting it in your armpit? <laughs> but, um, yeah, I'll be putting it in my armpit for safekeeping. The fumes can ignite from the flame. So dangerous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't. Mm -mm. I don't fuck with no, no flames. I love these nails already. I love it. I want to love you. So I'm trying to not fully bling out this nail, but uh, like you can still see peekaboos of the glitter down there. It's so cute. It's so fluffy. I'm going to die. Ya me estoy durmiendo. Duérmete pues, Marta. They're beautiful. Thank you. You lie, honey. You lie. I'm I'm starting to get a fucking headache. All right, I'm gonna put one more diamond here. Y no sean codas con con el glue. People that do nails and smoke are crazy for real. Like, dude, did you guys ever hear about this one salon? Um, I forgot what the name of it was, but. It caught on fire. I don't know if they found out what the reason was, but it's in LA. It caught on fire and one of the workers passed away. Well, he got burned, sadly. But I was like, what the fuck? Like, I don't know if he was smoking or what, but that shit was crazy. No, I haven't drank water, actually. I haven't drank water to... Well, did I drink water today? I don't remember. I drank a lot of water yesterday, though. Only thing I smoke while doing nails is my vape. I don't smoke nothing. I get high off the fumes only. So I'm thinking these nails I'm going to keep for a good while. Because they're so fucking cute. I love them. They're so cute. I already know somebody's going to want to copy me. One of my followers or something. One of my clients. Very pretty. Thank you. So we'll get a little glitter down here, a little glitter action right here. I wanna love you. Let's see how many minutes. How long have I been on here? For two hours and a half. Damn, we're breaking records over here. <laughs> he he he. Hey, for all this 3D little flower action, I'm I'm going pretty fast. Lay you good girl. Some of y'all gonna be like, bitch, please. Bitch, please. You got a mental disease. You still a slow hoe. I got my Zule collection. Oh, your Zeho collection. Woo! I hope you like it. Um, I think I'm gonna use um the blue ones on my next set. So I could do the unicorn. <sighs> my head hurts. Okay, let's see. I'm going to put a little bit of bling on this one too. Porque como se va a dejar. Como la vamos a dejar así. Posted a little video. Oh, I cannot wait to see. Did you tag me? I'm going to do some here. Yeah, everybody changed their picture today. I was just talking about that earlier. Like, y'all fucking with me tonight or what? Y'all fucking with me? Everybody play with me because they all changed their beachwood. Like, I don't recognize nobody. Yeah, rainbow fish. I'll probably use it with my blues. A little bit of rainbow fish in my life. So, make sure to come next time I do nails. I don't know if I'm going to do them on myself. Because I really, really love these nails. But, if I do... Those are going to be the colors. If not, I'll do it on my fake hand. On like Felicia or something. Depending. If we go to... 
So we're supposed to go to like a um, uh, viewing. Can I get advice, please? Sure. How do you get your nails so straight? I'm an upcoming artist. Like straight as in my finger straight? I try to guide myself because I have crooked fingers. Um, but I try to guide myself through the middle of your knuckle. So, for example, this finger goes to the right. I put my nail a little to the left. I put my nail a little to the left so they could be a little bit straighter. And then um, to get them snatched, snatched and crispy, I use... um. I use a 80 by 100 file and the on-point disc. If you haven't tried the on-point disc, honey, ooh, y'all need it. I think I'm going to bring that one to my class too, just in case. Because everybody always wants that one. I need to change my picture too. No, please don't. Don't change your picture. The on-point disc is this, this bit. You guys can use it to file the sides or the tip. Shapey, shapey, shapey. Do you like what color you use to make your flowers? The color is beautiful. I use the same colors from the nails. I use um, Glow Perfect Pink and um, Duckling. The same colors. I didn't use any other ones. If y'all want to get ignored, change y'all's picture. Uh-huh, exactly. <laughs> if y'all want to get ignored by Zule, change your picture because I have to double look. And like, who's talking to me? Who are you? I'm keeping the same basic pig, man. Yes, Carolina, please. Okay, and how do you get your site so crisp? Because when you lay the acrylic, I try my best to lay it as perfect as I can so that I don't have to really file the sides. So the key is pushing in your acrylic so you don't have to file the sides. I really don't file them as much. If you guys ever paid attention, I always just file the top and then a little bit of the side sometimes. But for the most part, the sides of my nails and tip just look like so weird. Um, Also, um, what kind of tips are you using? Are you using like curved ones? If you guys use curved nails, those are harder to file. Like your side walls are not going to be looking straight. They're going to be looking curvilicious. I use duck. Okay, yeah, those are kind of curvy, so maybe that's why. The bling box comes empty. You fill in yourself. Oh, thank you, Myra. Yeah, these these boxes they come empty, guys, and you guys could just um fill them up as you go. Like when you start buying little crystals and stuff, that's pretty much what I did. I started to fill them up. No, she's talking about um C curve. I mean not C curve. Ducks like curve, like literally like curved. That's why back then it was hard to shape nails, like to get a nice crisp crisp shape because they were curved. Alright. I always love to do a little curly, curly whirly bling action. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm trying to hurry up so I can put this on YouTube tomorrow. These are so cute. I love them. Empress Curve. Yeah. Can you do curved nails one day, Zule? Sure. Um, I do like curve, but I don't at the same time. Should I leave the other one simple? Or should I put like a little, a little bit of bling? I know you guys are the wrong people to ask, but just because they look kind of cute like this, huh? Zule, do you have gold flakes? Yes, we do. Oh, a little bit of bling. A little bit of manica in my life. They look so cute like this, bitch. Bling always. I know. I should just never ask you guys. Hold on. Let me take a little picture like this, too.
Ay, qué pendeja. I wasn't even recording. Qué estúpida. They look so cute. Dude, if they were curved, they would look kind of fire. All right. If you guys text me, um, wait until I'm done with the live and I'll respond to you. Uh, who are you asking if you need more bling? <laughs> it's because I like them as is. They look super cute. Like they look buchona vibes. But I guess I'll put a little bit more. Aha, uh -huh, buchi uñas. Few stones around the cuticle would be cute. Yeah, it's because sometimes less is more. Pero. Le voy a poner un poquito. Um, Leslie, you can, you can, um, go to the search option, to the search bar, and, um, enter gold, and then it will come out, gold flakes. Ajá, entre más, mejor, ¿verdad? Fuck, less is never more. <laughs> Not here. Not here, Felicia. Less is never more. Any tips on acrylic application up by the cuticle? So whenever you guys are working in the cuticle, try to point down your finger so the acrylic will flow down. And not into your skin. All right, I'm going to put a little bit of bling. Ponle un pinche piedra gran. No, hombre, que pin... No, no, no. Tenemos que estar classy, ¿ok? Classy. Tenemos que saber cuándo. Ponerle el molcajete. Ahorita. This color combo is everything. It's so cute, huh? You should be my twin. You should be my... Oh, you know what I just noticed? Sylvia, you changed your picture too, huh? Lesbi twins, everybody. Few, few. They look like um, un poquito does the whole nail. <laughs> they look like yogurt. Like I did. I know. I'm like, wait a minute. Who is you? Everybody changed their picture on me. Like what? I don't recognize you. Who is you? Literally, like five of y'all bitches change your freaking picture today what or since the last time i seen you no i'm not gonna do a cluster i'm not gonna do a cluster tonight i already did a cluster a few times we need a little break from them we need a little change new month new us damn i'm need to change my picture too for real you guys not gonna recognize me Next time, I could probably do a cluster. Right now, I feel like these nails are too coquette to put a cluster. Are they giving you guys coquette vibes or not yet? Because I didn't put a bow. Um, I'm disappointed. What happened to the year of the cluster? <laughs> it's over here. The cluster's over here. It's giving SpongeBob for real? I know, Marta, it's like Spongebob. Dubalin, andale, Dubalin. Dubalin nail. Yeah, that definitely giving Dubalin nails. Ya me está dando calor, wey. Algo, un, un, tiki, 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 tiki. Sherbert vibes. The way it is, I think it's gorgeous right now. Maybe a little more gems. <laughs> Echale, Marta. Echale. And la manita. Yes, I'm going to upload. I'm going to try to upload this tonight to YouTube. Um, If it doesn't get to upload, I'll put the ones, the green nails that I just had. Like the Trix yogurts. Andale. A tu si sabes. You know what song is stuck in my head? The Diabla song. Is that what it's called? The one from Javi? It is una Diabla. 
what Azule the color in the other hand online says it's 176 and 180 another pick i think it's an error no 180 is similar but it's not the same so 180 is more it has a different shift look let me show you i have them right here lucky 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 um where the fuck is 180 at Look, 176, 178, 180. 180 was actually the color that I wanted to do. So these two look kind of similar until you hit the light. It shifts. This one has more green in it. This one has more blue. Okay. I love, you know what? I, I didn't even know I had a pink, a pink cat eye gel, bitch. Look, I didn't even show it to you guys. What? That is what I've been wanting to do on myself. Pink cat eye. Hold on. Let me find the size. 16. Hold on. I'll show you guys. So it's 176 because I'm about to grab the next. <laughs> Yeah, um, the one that I have on my nails is 176. I was supposed to be grabbing 180, but I didn't have any more. But look it. Where is the pink one? What the fuck? Where'd it go? Look, bitch. There's a pink cat eyes, 189. You know how I almost did it like this? And then these three other ones are ones you guys are sleeping on too. I want to do 159. They're fucking fire. It has like rose goldy vibes. That 3D nail art is crazy. Thank you. Thank you, honey. Yeah, I'm trying to keep it semi-simple, but... El público no me deja. No me deja ser simple. No me dejan. Do you do character nail art ever? I have... I don't know how to paint. I don't know how to paint, if that's what you mean by nail art. Character nail art. I don't know how to draw. But occasionally I'll try to do something in 3D. Like I've done Olaf in 3D. I've done. I've actually done Peppa Pig before. <laughs> I should do Peppa Pig on my nails, huh? Are you going to post these on IG? Of course. What color stones are those? They're Crystal AB. Ed, Ed, and Eddie, and I'm scared. How cool! Mum. 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 Should we do some... Some... Pepper? Pepper pig? Some pepper? You want some pepper? I want to try Spongebob for sure. Hi, this one's a little too big. Oh, no. Oh, no. Are you filming a YouTube video? Um, well, I'm not. I normally save my lives. Minions. Yes, that's true. I need to do my nails. Yes, girl, you do. Do them yellow. Be my twin. We could be Twinkies. I dare you to do them 3XL pink. All right. Hold on, guys. I'm going to spray these nails right here. I'm using the Zule activator just in case you guys are going to ask. What are you doing, honey? So right now we have a, a bundle of, of the bling adhesive, the activator, and cluster gel. You guys were asking, make a Kevin. I do want to. You guys need to remind me. Do the little skunk, the Bambi. Qual? Oh my god. 
<laughs> that little fucker moved. Okay, hold on. Let me do this one too. Porta, um, Zule do minions. We been wanting to see since 2023. I know. I need to practice um, the minions. I do, I do. All right. This one, I'm going to be a little bit more fancy because pobre dedo. No le damos love. No le damos love al like pinche dedo gordo. So this is the other hand. It's like galaxy vibes. Okay, Zule, you have the wrong bling box because you don't have a lot of bling options on this hand. Ponte mas. Been waiting for minions. Ay, okay, guys. Slap me if I come up with any other idea that's not minions. Um, Nikki. Oh, you know what? I saw your order ship today. One of your orders. How many orders do you have? El Jefe um, was working on your order today. Oh, it was the Zeho collection, huh? Yeah, if you guys ordered... If you guys ordered the Zeho collection, we were a little behind on those orders, but they shipped out today. You'll get it probably tomorrow. Yes, guys, please bear with us. Um, we've been really busy, so thank you guys for being very patient and very um very um patient <laughs> Woo -hoo. yeah so if you guys live in california you'll get your order super duper fast if you guys live in texas arizona vegas um this side of town this side of the u.s you'll get them super fast if you guys live on the other side of the united states it'll take a little bit longer but you will get them by this week very supportive analyst so you guys know what I mean. It's because I cannot think sometimes. I can't think. Como que my, my thoughts. Like I I can't think. I can multitask pretty much when I'm doing the nails. It's hard. Fándale pinche diamond. Muévete. Muévete Marta. I wanna love you. I live in Paris. We're neighbors. Damn, for real. We are literally neighbors. You're like 30 minutes away. Hold on, guys. I'm going to spray this bitch. I want to love you. Está bien chueco, mi pinche bling bling. Nicky, 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 Nicky. The spray is so that the glue can dry. You know how it was moving around right now? It helps it dry faster. All right. So I'm trying to think what the fuck I'm going to put on here because I don't know, honey. I don't know. I'm going to put a little bit more. So, if you guys have never tried our glue, bling glue adhesive, I recommend it. It's fire, 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 fire. It helps the glue dry faster. Some people think it makes the bling last longer, but it doesn't. You don't have to use it, but I highly recommend it. Um, it just helps to dry it faster. Because somebody earlier said something like that. I'm like, what? What, what do you mean? Hello, nene. 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 Welcome. Welcome, everybody. Love this set. The galaxy hand goes crazy. Which one do you guys prefer? Let me see. Which hand do you guys like better? Do you guys like my left hand? Or if you guys like the left hand better, put happy face. If you like the yellow one better, put crying face. Okay, ready, set, go. Go, boat. Which one is your ultimate favorite? This one, happy face. This one, crying face. If you like them both, pick your most favorite. 
This one is the one that I went to jail in. So there's no video. I'm sorry. Ooh, the yellow one is winning. Ooh, 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 ooh. I am high like a kite. You want to kill up now? Bling, bling. Okay, let's see who's winning. Ooh, it's almost a tie. Which hand do you like better? Left or right? Left or right? Left or right? Left or right? Which one? Which one? Where? You... Ooh, the yellow hand is winning. Okay, it's super cute. They're both really nice. I'm going to try to keep these until right before my class. And then I'm going to be... Yeah, Marta, simple bling. <laughs> hey, ustedes son la de la culpa. Como que simple bling. Ustedes saben que yo no puedo parar sometimes. I've been doing my thumb basic, so I need to give it some love right now. Down the middle. So we could still see. Um, we could still see some some ombre. This set is giving spring. Yes. When does spring start on Sunday already? Can someone pin me? Zule, does the activator have a shelf life? Um, as long as you keep it in a cool temperature, it lasts as until you're done with it almost. Maybe that's a very good question. I need to ask. I've had my my activators for a long time. Like I've had a bunch for a long time before and nothing happened but as long as it's not too hot you should be fine like liquid things don't last very long like monomer if you put i guess we could put all our our liquid stuff in the refrigerator because the chemicals get all messed up in there but that's a good question i'm gonna say maybe like a year or two because the glue without opening could last you over a year. Oh, the 21st? Oh, it's the first day of spring. Oh, I thought it was already. The activator peels my top coat? What do you mean? Are you doing the activator first or after? Because if it's peeling your top coat, sounds like you're not cleaning your nails before you top coat. Jen. If you don't clean your nail after you spray activator. And, okay, let me reword that. So, if you apply your bling before top coat, spray activator, and then put your top coat and it's peeling, it's because you didn't clean the nail before putting the top coat. And it can happen with anything that, yeah, yeah, yeah. So try cleaning, try cleaning your nails um, before putting the top coat. Because if there's any little oils or anything on there, you'll have little circles and stuff. And that's when it'll start peeling. Yeah. So if you guys ever see little circles in your um, top coat. Is because your nail is not dirty, but there's like oil. What if the activator turns the nail white? Um, that means you need to get a different activator. Are you using which one are you using? It shouldn't turn your your thing white unless your bling is already like foggy because you took too long to spray. Um, you could just clean it with a napkin and the foggy goes away. Oh my god, thank you. I always wonder why my top coat got bubbly. Uh-huh. I didn't know that either as a beginner. Loki, I was like, I used to throw my top coats away because I used to be like, stupid top coat, you fucking suck. <laughs> Until I heard it on Instagram. Oh yeah, the Mia Secret formula is not good anymore, guys. That's why I stopped using it and I was kind of forced to um, get mine ASAP. I was already in a search for an activator way before that, but I'm pretty loyal. 
So I used to use Mia Speaker for many years, but ever since um they started um like they seal their activators, I think they changed companies or something. It does turn your stuff white. But my old one from three, yeah, yeah, they changed their formula. It even smells different and everything. It's a little bit stronger. Yeah, I had the Mia Secret one and it all evaporated. I only used it once. What? Okay, guys, let's put some bling, bling, bling. Yeah, I don't use that one anymore. I don't want to say it because I don't want you guys to think I'm just saying that. But how do you call it? Um, that one does make your glue dry white. I don't know what it has, but it do. Look, Sylvia, I have rings like you. I said it for you. I still love Mia Secret though. You no, know, yeah, Mia Secret is a great brand. It's just the activator is not the same anymore. I'm put a little bit of yellow. You, I'm a be buchona, honey. Where'd you get your rings? So I buy my rings from different places. Like this yellow one, I bought it at TJ Maxx. I bought the yellow one at TJ Maxx. This this one I sell it. This one I bought it from. I bought it from TJ Maxx. I think this one. If not, I bought it from Yeah Accessories. Um, like this little bit hensita one, I bought it from her too. Yeah, accessories. She's in here in TikTok. Most of my rings, I bought them from her. I love to support small businesses. Um, I also bought from TJ Maxx. This one, I bought it from TJ Maxx. The really big extra ones, I sell them on my website. Because, you know, Zule is extra. Love the nails. Look at how pretty. Okay, that one I'm not putting. Let me see. What else? Oh, I'm put about in play. Ha, uh, hmm. That's how I want my engagement ring. <laughs> yeah. So if you guys, hey, if your man don't want to give you one, you can buy one from Zule. If you're a little bit more basic, look at we have this one too. It's called the heart ring. This one is a little bit more simple. Hold on, let me clean it. Um. We have it in gold and in in rose gold. Um, this box is from TJ Maxx. También. I love TJ Maxx, guys. Um, what else what fucking ring can I put? Hmm. This actually looks kind of cute, huh? Oh, this one, this one, this one. What do I need for a beginner nail kit? You need a brush. You need a... That one's too big. You need a brush. You need files. You need nail tips. You need a um, monomer. Did I say a brush already? I like buying my sunglasses from there. Yeah, TJ Maxx has really good stuff. If you guys haven't um, gone to TJ Maxx lately, I recommend you go... Check it out. Oh, fuck. All right, hold on, guys. Let me put on my jean jacket for my nail feet. Primer. Um, I can't think right now. Huh. I'm so excited just to show you guys my nails. All right, guys. I really like to put my jean jacket lately. I just keep it in my room the whole time now. Así para que no se me vean los dedos muy gordos. Parecen chorizos. <laughs> Parecen chorizos mis uñas. Huh? Like, shoot, chorizo, longaniza, you name it. <whistles> All right, guys. These are the nails, the nails, the nails. Phew, phew. All right, guys. This is the end of our live. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, everybody who joined me today. And all the little likes. I appreciate you guys. What about Joe XK? Carolina, if you want reference items, go to my website. I have a 
Um, I have nail kits in there, so just so you could see what you need, and you could take a screenshot. I have both kind of kits there. No te vayas. Ya me tengo que ir. Ya son las once, Marta. All right, bye everyone. Sweet dreams. Thank you guys again for joining. I'll see you guys next time. Oh wait, let me show you guys how they glow. Hold on. This is the way. Let me hold on. I'm gonna put them to glow. Hold on. Don't go anywhere. I'm gonna show you guys how they glow. Hold on. Hold on. Don't go anywhere. Zoom, 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 zoom. Ooh, la la, el cucuy, el cucuy, el cucuy. Ni 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 the brighter they glow. Good night, ladies. One more time, I'm going to put them. Just so you guys can see that they grow, they glow brighter the more you cure them. Or like if you're out in the sun, they glow brighter and brighter. Look at, ooh, look at that, honey. Wow. This is the way we... Keep blow jobs, blow jobs. Hey, just kidding. <laughs> Turn off the nails. I'm like, ¿dónde estás? Aquí estoy. Aquí estoy. Okay, there, lamp. Turn off. All right, guys, that's it for tonight. Thank you again, Zule. You play, uh huh. Um, text me, um, Sharon, so I won't forget. Thank you in advance. I mean, dame the chupi chupi, mami, dame the chupi chupi. All right, bye guys. Good night. Bye bye. Thank you guys for the gifts too. I'll see you later. Bye. Buenas noches. Se lava la cola. Una noche más y copas de más. Tú no me dejas en paz. De mi mente no te.